Right now I just finished making our lunch. Look what we're having, our guilty pleasure. Yay, some instant noodles. Those are the instant noodles that I bought um, the other day at the Korean Mart place. They're like rupbuki noodles. Never tried them before, super excited. And then some seaweed salad uh, to help us cool off after the hot spicy taste because look how red that looks. Like, that is scary. I think my mouse is ready for vlogmas too. At the bottom green, on the bottom red, what? And so this is what I've been working at all day. It's kind of lame, but Yes Style has a Cyber Monday extended sale and it ends tomorrow at midnight. Um, but I picked up some things that I haven't stocked up on in a while, such as the Kiss Me Hair and Make Long Curl Mascara. I picked up a bunch of blouses in various colors, and then a makeup brush cleaner, like the ones with those like beads on them, and some eyeliner that apparently the reviews say that it doesn't smudge at all. Uh, the Tony Moly Banana Hand Milk Lotion. I've been eyeing that for so long at Hudson's Bay, but it's like super expensive. It's like three times the price. price. Um, and then a, a mini skirt in pink. And then um, that Chateau Labote wine lip tint that everyone's been raving about in the last year or so. Uh, that was on sale for only $11, so I thought I would try it. And then I also got a free gift. We're just about to go out for uh, the one sushi buffet. I am home from the buffet, sushi buffet that we had, but there is always room for advent calendar chocolate. Now, oh, I found, I found number two. Can you guys see that two, that golden two? That's very, very disguised within the um, Christmas tree here. I'm just gonna try to open it. I think it's the two. Okay, hopefully it is. Ah, come on. Ooh, it's so fancy. It like comes with like its own wrapping paper almost. Oh my gosh. It is a elf no man with a dog. That's quite cute. I love um, Having nachos right now. It's a late 11 p.m. snack because I'm craving salty foods for some reason. <sighs> I guess I'm still hungry. Whoa, where did that trip go? Mmm, mm, salty craving has been satisfied. And cooking us dinner. And we just got home from grocery shopping, so avocados, kale, and a whole mess all over the kitchen. So it's Vlogmas Day 3 right now, and sorry that I didn't vlog that much yesterday. We just like went out for dinner with um, our crew, and then we went home, and then like we really didn't do anything but like open that admin calendar and then I just like chilled the whole time but uh, yeah today was quite eventful it is Sunday which kind of makes me sad because I, I wanted to enjoy more of my weekends like I wanted a longer weekend but that's okay I'm just used to that because of the staycation um, but we did go and visit our friend's uh, baby and then we saw our friends we chilled and stuff and then uh, just after that we came home and then we went to go do some grocery shopping uh, that was much needed and Dan's just cooking some curry right now so we'll have that in a second. While I'm waiting for dinner to be prepared I'm just working on my uh, bullet journal so some of you probably might know or don't know um, but I've been doing some bullet journaling for maybe around a year right now actually. My cousin actually introduced me to it. I did know more about bullet journaling before that, um, but I wasn't really like into it and I was like, what's the point? Like it seems so micromanaging me and like I hate that. But um, my cousin showed me his and I was like, oh, this is really cool. So I started doing it at home with my own journal that I bought and then, um, which is actually this one, this one right here, it's like got a bunch of hedgehogs on it. I actually got this from Daiso. I think I got it from Daiso. Yeah, I got it from Daiso in Vancouver. Um, and it was like, it's only $2. I still have the price tag on the back. Um, but it's 
It's actually lasted me a year so far and I'm only halfway through it because when I first began with it, I didn't really take it too seriously. Like I was doing just like normal bullet journal stuff. So that's what it looked like. And then I think around like the summer of this year, yeah, I started getting a little bit more serious with adding colors and like customizing all my like day titles and how my week looked and stuff. And then it started looking like this. And then that was like too much of an upkeep for me because like I literally needed to like write in it all the time. And then I just kind of stopped in like September. Just cooking some rice over here. It's getting really bubbly looking. When I first got this rice cooker, I was like, oh my gosh, did we put like soap in the rice or something? Just cooking the curry right now. Ooh. And so we got the veggies bubbling up and then we got some onions frying. Oh yeah, look at that curry. Bon appetit. Mmm, looks so good. Meal prepping. Here are my salads for the week. They have corn, kale, spinach, um, some turkey, deli meat, and some sweet salad. So it'll be very, very flavorful but filling. I was gonna put some avocado in it, but I got too lazy and I didn't want to cut an avocado. Um, and then this giant piece of tinfoil here is my wrap. So basically, it just has the same thing as this, except no seaweed salad. All right, so it's December 3rd, so now it's time to open the advent calendar. So what's hidden behind Santa's face? Oh, okay. Here we go. Ooh. Ooh, it's a Lindor chocolate. Yum. Well, all of these are Lindt chocolates, but I guess this is called the Lindor chocolate. It's really good. I think this is the hazelnut flavor. Why won't you focus? We got a scale finally. Wait. Oh, are you 538 pounds? No, we're just measuring some shelves. There's some complex math that goes on here. Just take away Dan's weight and then that's the weight of the shelf. Now let's see how much I weigh. Is this in pounds or kilos? It's kilo. Oh, how do you... You can't do it in pounds? Okay. Google, what is 51.9 kilos in pounds? 51.9 kilograms equals 114.42 pounds. Oh my gosh, I lost one pound, guys.